Hello, I'm Leslie Logan, and today we're going to do hip circles on the spine corrective. So hip circles on the spine corrector. Not sure I love them any more than I love hip circles on the mat. Um, but I will say it's a great place to practice them. Um, so if you've been doing stomach massage and you've been practicing your teasers all around the room and you've been practicing your corkscrews and your hip circles on the mat just torture you, this is a really good place to practice them, feel supported, and then go back to your mat work, right? So you would set yourself up like you did for teaser facing away, right? And then you can grab these handles here. Now you don't want to be here and you don't want to be here, right? So you, for, depending on the arm length, you're going to have to maneuver your elbows in a way that you connect to your back. So my arms are connected to here. So I'm not pushing myself out of it. And I'm also not resting, right? Then you circle your legs and you try to make these circles as big as they can come from your seat. And because you've got this barrel here, it's so much easier to keep your pelvis in the same position and to keep you working that lift without you having to hold yourself up, right? Because my hands aren't so low. When you do hip circles on the mat, your hands are pretty low. For some of us, it's just not there yet. So I highly recommend instead of going onto your elbows, practice on something like your spine corrector, and then you can get onto the mat. And for me, if you have a mat with handles, you can actually scoot back and it's not a cheat, but it's just another way to support yourself. So your hands are hitting the mat, but you're working with straighter arms. Um, again, not locking in the elbows out, right? But this is by far, like, it's so much more pleasurable. And then if you have someone around, they can grab your feet and pull them to your face, Ugh, right? So if somebody was here to teach me, they could pull my feet up and I would have to make sure I don't crouch down right? So try it, get someone to help you and really challenge your hip circle control. It's going to make it so much more fun on the mat. If you have any questions about this, make sure you put them in the comments below. I love chatting with you. I love getting to know where you're from and what help you need with your exercises and creating these videos for you. So I so appreciate you and I will see you next time.